Well, 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 my friends. Or should I say buddies? Or perhaps pals? I see what you I'm did fi- there. Did you, did, you, did you see that? I'm finally fucking hosting a quiz. Oh, my God. Thrilled. Oh. Absolutely everyone loved when Nico did it, so I thought I might as well hop on one. And so here we are. I'm talking about the hotly brand new game on the block. It's Pal World, baby. Monster Catching's our our, our our game, and this is also a game with Monster Catching. So, how this is going to work is just like every other f-ing quiz that we do, I'm just going to hit them with five questions. There's one bonus question at the end. Going to see if these boys can figure out what the names of these little pals are. Cause some of them are really goofy. Some of them are pretty confusing. I just went with a bunch of the ones that I personally really like. I know there's a lot of drama with the plagiarism. I kind of try to stay away from that, but it's kind of hard because there's a lot. Um, but <laughs> <laughs> but um, and I also wanted to say before we start, uh, there is not a lot of like official art for any of these little dudes anywhere. So a lot of these images are probably going to be pretty poor quality. Apologies. It, the game is in early access and just came out in early access like days prior to recording this. So let's jump into it, boys. Question number one. Possibly my favorite of the little dudes of of this game. Can you tell me what this fella's name is? His name is now, Charles. <laughs> before we even get into that, Tyler got a point now. Oh, sure. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Before we, I have a little bonus thing to throw in at the beginning of each of these. Before I even tell you like the options for names, the the Pokemon typing that there is in Pokemon, there are elements to these uh, pals. Mm, yes. Um, and I'm just gonna have you guys just straight up guess. What do you think the element of this little dude is? And I'll have that for every round. Just go ahead and throw them out there. Explosive. You think? <laughs> Plasma. They're very similar to Pokemon types. Okay, okay. Gun. Land. <laughs> no one got it. It's water and ice. Wow. Oh, damn. Amazing. damn. I feel like I was pretty I- close, though. You know, you can't have an explosive without matter that could also be in liquid form or solid form that could be water or ice. You know, I thought you were going to go with, like, you can't have bombs without a testing site. <laughs> yeah, that too. Penguins are flightless birds, so they are landbound. That's so true. Hey guys, here are your options. We've got Penzuka, Pengruff, Pengullet, and Tap a Flap. One of those is not like the others, Kyle. It <laughs> certainly isn't. Huh. What could that mean? Mm, I don't I'll, know. I'll go first. I'm well first of all, does anyone know what this is? I guess no. if no, you do absolutely not. If any of you um, happen to have seen the names of these, wait to go last. Yeah, I, I have general. I've seen I have designs, seen, okay. but not a yeah. lot of names. I have I've seen, seen the, the first reveal trailer for this game, and that is it. Mm. Cool. <laughs> well, what's your guess, Mitch? I'm gonna go with because this game is a Pokemon with guns. I'm gonna pick Penzuka. Damn it, that's the one I, I want to really pick. Want it to? I, I, I'm just thinking about shooting it out of a bazooka. <laughs> mm. I want to use it as a projectile. Yeah, True. I'm also gonna go with Penzuka because I guessed explosion and I saw a video this morning of someone shooting it out of a bazooka. I think <sighs> it was that. So I'm gonna guess Penzuka. I tried really hard to like avoid anything about any gameplay. Sometimes some no, of it just snuck up on me. No, that's fair. Nico, what's your guess here? Pen gullet. <laughs> Interesting choice. Well, I, I, I hope you know there 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 are points out there. There are points out there, and it's okay. actually Nico's. Whoa! Oh. Hey, yo. Oh <laughs> the thing you saw was correct, but Let's it's a mixture go. of penguin and the word bullet, because he's a bullet that you should have a, like a uh, rocket launcher. Uh, you don't so shoot bullets not- out of rocket launchers, mm. Kyle. That's fucking you stupid. You don't? I thought it was but about its stomach. play on words, and I purposely made Penzuka to try to, to, you know... To quote my friend Kyle, that's fucking dumb. <laughs> this is dumb. <laughs> <laughs> I added a reference image in case you haven't seen it. Oh, wow. He's staring at the camera. Yeah. Wow. He, he's not staring at your character. He's staring at you. That also, is that, 
That screenshot, that looks like Raiden from Metal Gear. I was going to say, <laughs> that does. That's one of the hairstyles you can pick. But Amazing. yes, that's incredible. So I also wanted to tell you, just give you a little rundown because y'all don't know a lot about this. So I, get, I I brought in the PAL deck entry, which is the mm -hmm. Pokedex, but for this. Um, so Pangolet's uh, PAL deck entry is, the feathers of this PAL have all but disappeared. But sadly, its desire to fly has remained as strong as ever. Even now, it tries to fly again in any way it can which is why I think it likes to get shot out of a rocket launcher. Um, <laughs> it's and actually then, a little cute. And then yeah. all of them have a, a partner skill that, that you can unlock with them, and the partner skill for this little fella is indeed Pengullet Cannon. Uh, when activated, the player equips a rocket launcher and fires Pengullet as ammunition. Pengullet explodes on contact and is incapacitated. So the fact that you just kept talking about explosiveness was really fucking funny <laughs> because... It actually explodes and is a, is a bomb. Yay! Um, so they, water ice type. <laughs> water ice water type ice explodes type. in a fiery fucking explosion. Yeah. There you go. Well, we're on to round two. Let's take a gander at this little fella. It monkey. Weed monkey. Hello. Weed monkey. Gra His name is Weed monkey. Chimchar. His type is weed. It is just mm. a weed leaf on his head, but... Um, Mitch, do you, Mitch and Nico, do you guys have guesses on its element? Squeamish. <laughs> what? <laughs> Squeamish. What? Um, uh, pure grass. It sure is pure grass. This is a pure grass. Yeah, lad. that good grass. That that fun okay. grass. If you know, yeah, I was right. Yeah. Give me okay. points, please. You were kind of right. So. I was right. <laughs> they're, they're, no one gets points for these. This is why exactly yeah. why I didn't make these worth points. Oh, that's um, They're just you, fun. Yeah, you named a plant. Yeah. <laughs> so here are your options for this little fella. We've got Tansy, Capunchin, Branchimian, and Tokimer. So Tokimer is weed type. That's <laughs> confirmed. He's uh, themed after the devil's mm -hmm. list. That makes me think Tokimer, but that's also dumb. The last one was called Pengullet, and it was indeed a rocket. You're so right. It's I Tokimer. <laughs> Final answer, it's Tokimer. All right. <laughs> Who would like to go next? I just like saying Capunchin. Mm. <laughs> I hate you. So is I that your pick that. then? Is that is that your pick, Mitch? Are you picking now, especially Pungeon? now that Nico has detested me for it? Yes. <laughs> cool. You've fallen into my trap this whole time. I wanted Bren Chimmy in. You I, I, I know it's wrong, but oh god, wait, is he coming to me? He's oh no, he's going to <laughs> 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 God, the waveform on that's gonna be a fucking brick. <laughs> Holy shit, that was such a fucking explosive boom. Um, well, well, my door, I watched my door move when he hit it. I didn't like it. <laughs> I assumed it moved. It was quite loud. Um, <laughs> well, boys, you've fallen into all of my traps. The name of this little fella is Tansy. That's, that's the stupid. one I didn't Why? want. <laughs> That's Why? really yeah. dumb. What is it? What does it come from? My monkey. Chimpanzee. <laughs> <laughs> he does it's what it looks like when it has its ability out. It just I shoots. Know. Okay. Um. <laughs> okay. I'm actually, you know, I'm really mad at myself because I've seen that exact image. Yeah, online. I've seen that image okay. too. Um, but like I've seen it with, with the name. name and shit and I just oh, I didn't oh. even <laughs> I was very That's proud incredible. of Capunchin and Branchimian, uh, mm -hmm. and my wife was very uh, happy with coming up with You know, that makes a lot of <laughs> sense now. Did your wife come up with, with the last one on all of them? No. Did she, did she provide an answer for, like, each each round? We, we, she helped me with all of these, mm -hmm. uh, in a lot of, at least a lot of them. I, whenever I got stumped, we worked out whether it was, like, two left, one left, or whatever. Oh, okay, gotcha. Uh, Bro, not only is he lying, but he's French. He answered your question with wee oui, wee oui, and then denied it. Oh. I hate <laughs> this channel. I hate our friendship. Um, mm, yeah. So anyways, Tansy, uh, Tansy's pal deck entry, one of my favorites. Uh, long ago, this pal used long objects like tree branches as weapons. After coming into contact with humans, however, it found something much more effective. Guns. 
Um, <laughs> this game is real and performing wildly well. Um, <laughs> I wonder why. <laughs> and its partner scale is titled Cheery Rifle. Uh, when activated, Tansy will mercilessly fire an assault rifle at nearby enemies. And that is what you see there. It's Tansy's shooting. Very okay. cool. Well, we're on to round three. Um, I've now, I picked one that I like. But also is like I think the poster child for this game in some ways, because oh. the Twitter icon is this this fella. Take a gander at this duty. I have seen that thing before that's the, in trailers. That's, that's the poster child. Well, they like the profile for the Pal World official Twitter is that, and I think I think they just really like this guy. I think this is just I, one of the ones they really like. It's also the it, icon for the game. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I think no, he must be the no, Charizard. Oh my god. Of of power, oh, I, you can't lie to me. That is a Plato spore creature. <laughs> that is just Gudra if it was designed slightly better. <laughs> you think that's better than Gudra? Yeah, because he's not he's not dripping. Gudra? It's just he's Gudra if he was solid. He ain't dripping. It's dry Gudra. Gudra. It's Gudra. Gudra. <laughs> Gudra. <laughs> well, mm. first. The, 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 we're back again. Give me what you think the element of this fella is. Dry. Okay. <laughs> what would you say? <laughs> Mish, what did you say? That I didn't hear what you said. It's, it's, uh, did I stutter? Duck. <laughs> Duck. <Okay. laughs> I was in disbelief that that's what I heard, so I wanted to make sure. Okay, and Nico, do you have a real guess? <laughs> Wallace from Wallace and Gromit. <laughs> I like your real guess. No one but like the Telltale version. <laughs> um, <laughs> the element of this fella is dragon and water. So mm. I was y'all close. so close. Yep. Yeah. Mm. With dry. See, yeah, yeah really duck close. is is yeah. is their their waterfowl. Ah, I see, I see. I've got a perfect. And birds are close to dinosaurs. So yeah, we we were all correct. I think. In yeah. Our own ways. No. Everyone gets imaginary point for that. Cool. Um, mm -hmm. Very cool. Mm -hmm. So anyway, here are the names. <sighs> You've got Hydrodon, Tankiosaurus, Aquarex, and Relaxorus. Relaxorus is so good. Kyle, if you came <laughs> up with that, or if your wife came up with that, mad respect. Um, I, I don't think you're that clever, that. though, so I'm going to guess Relaxorus. I want to do Aquarex. <laughs> I... I don't really have a reasoning behind it. Okay. <laughs> oh, that's fair. Tankiosaurus has your initials like monogrammed across it. Mine? Uh, it's yeah, 100%. What? Yeah. Cuz it has a K in it. What? <laughs> <laughs> Tankiosaurus. Uh, uh Hydrodon. My voice. What are you <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Well, it's really funny that you say that Nico cuz Tankiosaurus is one that my wife came up with. Um, oh. <laughs> uh, uh. And it's one still the same initials. <laughs> <laughs> that's honestly fair. It's anyway, actually, that's <laughs> true. You're a genius. You know who else is a genius? Tyler, because the name of this butt buddy is Relaxerus. Yeah. <laughs> that was actually a uh, that I didn't think it would be because that sounds too much like Haxerus. We uh, we established this game has a lot of plagiarism issues, right? We we said that up front. Oh, that's what plagiarism is. <laughs> <laughs> How many ideas have you stolen? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, yeah, wait a minute. <laughs> we're the first YouTube channel to do quiz format, so yeah, yeah I, we actually invented the concept of a quiz. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, well, I know you guys are just waiting to find this out. Um, the pal deck entry of Relaxerus is contrary to its blase appearance. It's quite ferocious. It perceives everything in its sight as prey and will stop at nothing to devour it. Oh, this thing eats everything and it's very aggressive, <laughs> bro. I want to watch uh, this thing chew. How relaxing. <laughs> I don't think it does. I think it just, I think it gives what, I think it does what a duck does. I think Mitch was right. I think it just kind of <laughs> see duck type. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, everyone's right yet again. Um, now, the hidden ability of this buddy, well, not hidden ability, the partner ability, um, is called Hungry Missile. Um, the first part of this is just can be ridden, which I think 
is just for anybody that you can ride in this game gets that as part of their partner skill. But for some reason, it's listed like within the the hungry missile text, unless that's just something that I didn't find like there's incorrect on the wiki. But the main cool thing about this buddy is that you can rapidly fire a missile launcher while riding him. And here is a poor image oh of God. him holding his missile launchers up oh. where you just fire them at oh. things. Wow. Why did I think they were going to come out of his mouth? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't know what I was picturing, but it wasn't that. And <laughs> this is so much better. He's it just not cartoon style. He's just like, man, whoop, and they're there. Yeah, just like, oh, someone, like this. <laughs> if, it, if it doesn't exist already, I need fan art of this thing shooting missiles at a uh, metal guru Mon also shooting missiles. We go. There we Those go. missiles remind me of a very specific Yu-Gi-Oh card uh, that I remember the oh for. What is it? Guru cannon Ramon. spider? Yeah. Oh. Or cannon launcher spider? Launcher spider? Yeah. Launcher spider. Yeah, yeah. As a score update, we've got Nico with one and Tyler with one. Oh my gosh! Here's your next little pal. I want him. That's I actually I want him so much. That's I really yeah. like this guy. He's pretty. Oh cool. my god. Um, Beetle yep. Umbreon. We're, we're back into realm of things I really like. Um, so what do you think the element of this pal is? Peggable. Horny. <laughs> that was a mistake. <laughs> what? Oh, uh, so your option. <laughs> no, but what's its type? Oh, it's ground grass. Okay. It's not no even bug. bug. There's no bug. Okay. There's no, no bug. No, there's no bug. There's no bug. No bug. Oh, this game sucks. Damn, they really didn't plagiarize that well then. No. Nah. They, they a lot of the types exist. Normal is also referred to as neutral, which is interesting. Okay. But it's That's like a pretty like, normal thing. Is, Function is the same. No, it's a pretty neutral thing, actually. Yeah, no. Nah, oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, your options are Resilient, War Beetle, War Sect, and Armor Roach. That's mine. I'm picking that one. Armor Roach? Which one? <laughs> Armor Roach. <laughs> Armor Roach? Okay. All right. Damn. I was going to pick that, too, because that's the, the coolest name out of all of them. But also, I will not be upset if it's Resilient. <laughs> that also just sounds like Armor Rouge. Oh. From the new game. close to that. I'm going to go War Beetle's too uncreative. And War Sect is why isn't. War Sect at least sounds cool er than War Beetle <laughs> cuz War Beetle is just two words. It's War Beetle. War Sect is war and then half of a word, which makes it mm. slightly more effort. I'm going to go with War Beetle as the real one cuz I don't think Kyle or his wife whom I respect uh, would come up with a, a fake answer that lazy and stupid. Mm, interesting. Okay. His smirk is making me think that I've made a mistake, but I will stick with my answer. In your answer and we're going to move on. Nico, <laughs> what do you think? That's not an and. Good observation. What does that mean, though? <laughs> <laughs> I'm choosing resilient and I'll be mad if I'm right. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Welp. Threw in a stupid one to fool you. <laughs> there was, War Beetle is a fake answer. Uh, Nico, you're correct. It isn't an ant. That's why I made that up to throw you off. Resilience <laughs> fake. And Good. guess what? I also could come up with bangers. I came up with Armor Roach. The real name is War <laughs> Damn Sex. it! <laughs> I like I to really, keep it spicy. <laughs> that's the one I really wanted the want, least. <laughs> I wanted to choose War Sec. That, that seemed like the most realistic, but... Yeah, considering it's, it's, Penn Gullet earlier, I, 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 it really set a weird tone. Exactly his, uh, why I picked that to be first. <laughs> it's his pal ability, Warsectomy, and he uses those big old pincers to get you clipped. Whoa. <clears throat> no. Uh, oh, that's a shame. So his partner skill is hard armor. Uh, when fighting together, increases players' def uh, defense and applies fire damage to all of players' attacks, which is oh. really fucking good. Um, not nearly as goofy and funny as the other ones have been, but it's just a good ability. And I, I just picked him because I think he's cool. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> fire damage? Uh-huh. Let that one sink in. He's grass. Um, grass ground. <laughs> uh-huh. Anyways, <laughs> that's the explanation I have for that one. There is none. Um, the, pal deck, <laughs> the pal deck entry of this fella is the ultra hard armor surrounding its body is extremely strong and heat resistant. 
Even a napalm blast would hardly leave a scratch. So that's neat. neat. Um, I just I like, like this guy. He's not necessarily <laughs> the most interesting of the bunch that I've picked from, but I just really thought he was cool. He's like the one of the first ones that jumped out to me. I was like, I like him. He's cool. I, like. I like him. Yeah. Uh, He's cool. Even though a lot of these designs are kind of um, <clears throat> noticeable, I, I like <laughs> a lot of them. I think a lot of them are good. And this one is, doesn't necessarily give me vibes of anything else other than like general bug other things from other games. But Heracross. he's pretty unique. No, no. I, I don't really get Heracross at all. And like, I guess you could say Pinsir, but like, not really. It's like if Heracross and Pinsir were, well, no. No. I mean, he does have Pinsir's. Heracross hands, is but... bipedal beetle, though. It is like mega Heracross what? and Pinsir, Ooh. maybe, kind of. Mm. So mm. is um, uh, the uh, Spectrobe. Edit me in saying the right name. No. Villamasta. Villamasta. Ah. <laughs> it's Kabuteri Mon. <laughs> or, or Hercule B. Tolma. Hercule. Uh, you know the Move one. Move on. Put it on the screen. Okay, back to pals in Pal World. <laughs> We're on to fucking question five. Oh my lord. I think this one's a bit of a fan fave. I'm not going to lie. You'll see why. This is our round five pal. Oh my good god. Oh yes! Oh my lord! Now, this is a w oh round five. Okay. It's like if round it's like five. if Empoleon fucked a Growlithe and then produced an alpaca. <laughs> Wise words from you. <laughs> <laughs> Am I wrong though? I'm not gonna say you're right though. <laughs> I'm definitely not gonna say you're right. Um, should we have a censor? No. <laughs> Sometimes I wonder. What do you guys think the element of this fluffy fella is? In Fat. <laughs> okay, wait, wait. You said alimony. Nico. And you said <laughs> alimony. And what did you say, Tyler? Uh, inbred. Oh, inbred. Yes, of course. Uh, so it's neutral element. Um, <clears throat> they, I mean, inbred's pretty neutral <laughs> as far as typing goes. The neutral Every game is wild. <laughs> Boy, everyone gets a point. Then. No. Um, I don't know what the pH level of fat is. So, uh, here are your options for the last normal round. We've got Magifluff, Royal Lamb, Queen Puff, and King Packa. Nico, you first. Me first? You first, mm. Nico. Okay. Because Mitch just knighted it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Mitch knows. Oh, Mitch knows. I don't. Oh, but you haven't done first yet. <laughs> <laughs> Most of the time. So. That's fair. Uh, I, mm, uh, ooh. I just like how round it be. Uh, I don't, ooh, I don't, I don't know. I, I'm going to say Queen Puff. Uh, is not right. I'm going to say King Packa. Which one are you locking in? King Packa. King Packa. Wow. Okay. I'm Wait going it. with Queen Puff. Thank you. You're going with Queen Puff? I'm going with Queen Puff because it sounds like Cream Puff. And he's, yeah, Mitch supports women, unlike Nico, who changed his wow. answer. Wow. Mm -hmm. Nico he, backs away from pushing women. the patriarchy. He's got, he, he's got me down. He's, he's, he's pegging me. I think Royal Lamb is the best name, but also that's not a lamb, so I'm going to go Magifluff. Mm. Mm -hmm. Well, the patriarchy strikes again. <laughs> <laughs> King Packa is <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you know, until I heard Mitch say Queen Puff, I didn't realize that it sounded like Cream Puff, and the second you said Cream Puff, I went... Oh, Kyle made that shit up. <laughs> <laughs> I need you to know. I, I was like <laughs> sitting there kind of trying to come up with it today. I looked at Kelsey. I was like, I want to have something that's like king versus queen because king is it. Maybe there's a queen. We'll be able to throw them off. And I sat there going queen, queen, queen. It's puffy. But <gasps> I like cream puffs and queen puffs. <laughs> sounds like cream puffs. Fucking hate you. So I'm really glad Mitch said that out loud. <laughs> <laughs> all right patriarchy one point um all right so the yeah that point does not go to nico <laughs> <laughs> yeah it goes to patriarchy but no nico is now leading um so anyways pal deck entry for king paka mel paka serve this pal which i'll show you in a moment uh contests between king paka offer up their vassals as a wager those seen alone are losers of such contests <laughs> um, oh, no. <laughs> yeah 
I didn't, I hadn't seen what a Melpaca was yet until I saw that and I was like, let me look it up. This is Melpaca. Oh. Not it's a bit related. Tall. Mm. Oh. Not related, just another Paca. Okay. Huh. This reminds Where me of the, the legs off of Sylveon and shoved it onto an alpaca. Um, Y'all ever seen Beep Beep? I'm a sheep. <laughs> oh God. Um, <laughs> also, I think you said I'm leading. I don't think I am. You I are. Think I'm tied. Two. No, it's you have two. two. I have Did one. You? Mitch has zero. Oh, mm -hmm. I thought you guessed Warsect correctly earlier. No, I pivoted oh. to War Beetle because I said Kyle wouldn't come up with something that stupid, even though Warsect sounds better. Um, yeah, he okay. was like saying. Yeah. A compliment, but like made it in the form of an insult to me. Yeah, because yeah, it was yeah. masterfully done. I didn't even know. Masterfully. Masterfully. I think I should yes. get a point for deceiving Nico into thinking. No, I the so right partner okay. skill of King Paca <laughs> is <laughs> the partner skill of P King Paca. I like this one is King of Muscles. Uh, while in your team, King Paca helps carry supplies, increasing the player's max carrying capacity, which is a uh, Banger fucking ability. Uh, another uh, early mon, uh, Kativa, is one that you can, uh, his little cat guy, gives you the same ability. So which you is can really cool. alpaca a lot. You shut with up! Him and shut up! I hate you! I hate wow. you! I hate you! <laughs> wow. I don't like this game! Stop! <laughs> well, I, I hope you really love it. Because there's one more question. It's a bonus round, baby. We're on the bonus Whoa. round. Holy ah. cow. Nico is leading right now with two. Tyler's got one. Mitch has got zero. So we're going to make this guy worth two points. So wow. that way, loser man over there, Mitch, can at least tie the leader if he gets it. And no. then Tyler can jump ahead or Nico can just run away with it. So here is your final pal of the day. <laughs> that is what Quaxley should have evolved into. Huh? Interesting take. Haven't heard that, but I can see it. <laughs> so, here are... Wait, we're not oh, wait, guessing for, its type? Oh, yes. Element. What do you think the element is? Pim. I think this one's... Okay. <laughs> Water are nice. And Midge? Goro Majima. Nico is correct. It's one. <laughs> All right, here are your four options. We have got Kapengan, Swashwaddle, Penzuka, and Penking. Swear to God, if it's Penzuka. I am locking in on Penzuka. Let's go. I'm locking in on Swashwaddle because that just is fun to say, which means Kyle definitely made it. But I, I'm going with it anyway. Nico. Yeah. <laughs> what are you gonna pick, buddy? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I really hate Pen King. It's worked out for me before. It's Pen King. I should. I was just locking in on that. Well. I'll have you know, the winner has not changed. Because Nico oh. guessed it correctly. It's oh, Pen wow. King. Wow. Wow. Oh, That's my gosh. not good. That was the least good of all of them. Yeah, it's really bad. <laughs> it's not great. Oh. It's, not, it's not a good day. He's not not good. You need to know I will go all in on a repeat answer. <laughs> I, I was going to say. I was really surprised you did that because I definitely let it slip earlier that I came up with that name. And I said it. I went, fuck. <laughs> oh well, I'm glad you still guessed it. I know, um, but I went all in. <laughs> good. All right. Well, here is its pal deck entry. Surprisingly, it is unrelated to Pen Gullet. Um, ever wanting to be the center of attention, this pal will shred its stuff for any onlook onlookers. And then the partner skill, which continues to confuse me on the naming choice of this buddy, is Brave Sailor. <laughs> when fighting together, fire pals drop more items when defeated. Why is it a king then? I don't know. <laughs> it's a king of the sea. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. It's the, the king of flightless he's, birds. He's a sea and, king, like the Pokemon. Because here is an image of it sliding along on its belly, being I love fucking him. cool. I also love him. I, I, love I, him I think these so two might be like my faves. But yeah, that's it. Nico wins with four points. <laughs> 
<gasps> Look at you go, buddy. You wow. got half of them right, and you still got four points. Are you proud of yourself? No. Cool. What do you guys think of uh, Power World's uh, designs? This is just a little taste, but what do you think? Um, of I think that they're pretty cute overall, and the just the concept of cute uh, animals with gun is hilarious, and I understand why this sold like a billion copies in a day. <laughs> I like the designs. They're not the most original. That's just tall, yeah. flaffy, but like it, it's cool. I yeah. don't like the monkey. It's a weed monkey with an AK-47. It's That is America <laughs> <laughs> as a design. Don't, don't ask for us to do another episode of this because we're all going to play it. Yeah, uh, <laughs> so yeah. we're all going to know yes. them all and we can't do another episode of this. But we figured we hop on while I knew that these three didn't play it yet. I've only played like a couple hours of it. It's super fun. I really like it. In the comments below, if you have an opinion on if this game is plagiarizing Pokemon, let me know. Tell, tell us in the comments. Have that a discussion. If, there, if there's one thing I know about the internet and the people of it, they don't have opinions and they don't share them ever. And they certainly don't have discussions about them. And they never, they, they would never hit the like button on a video they enjoyed, mm -hmm. especially if it were this one. Or, or sure smash don't. that subscribe button if they haven't subscribed already. They probably also wouldn't smash that notification bell so they know every time a video of ours goes live. No one's ever done that. I'm subscribed to zero people on any platform. I've never hit the subscribe button. No. It's funny wow. you mentioned any platform as well, because I bet you no one would go into the uh, description below and look at all of our social medias and follow us on all of our social medias where we post fusion reactions on our TikTok, our Instagram, and our YouTube shorts right here. Wow, fucking shill.